bunker down the right hand side and we have the potential for a very difficult pin placement all the way back and the Goodyear blimp giving us those tremendous views the Santa Clarita Valley on a clear blue sky great day in Southern California hard to believe that in the summer it doesn't rain for months after what we've had the last couple of months to the 18th well at 18 now this is the group of fair Ames and Hoke and Ames to play his third shot want to warn you we will not be able to stay on to the conclusion of the third round due to the slow pace of play well the last group is a whole par five behind but tomorrow we're back here four o'clock eastern time that'll be preceded by college action Georgetown and Syracuse at noon followed by regional play some will see Purdue Michigan State in the Big Ten Michigan State and Purdue with Illinois keeping a close eye on that a tangled situation at the top of the Big Ten that'll be settled by this game tomorrow and UCLA Washington some will see on the West Coast and there we are four o'clock Nissan open back at Valencia to 17. has this length putt he's missed was it two or three today of this length of course he's been on a roll second portion of the back nine forcing his way to minus nine at the top of the leaderboard just like the ninth hole where David talked about similar chip shot he has a similar length putt it's right to left and it doesn't suit his stroke cutting the ball back up against the slope on the ninth and bogey the hole he misses again here so short part still to go if they're both hold Mayfair and Armour both eight under but Tommy Armour still has his par putt to play that's the length Peter that's really bothered him He's uh, looking like he's going to get in front and, and get away, and then that just yanks on his leash. We had a good view there of how the left hand moves, cuts the face open through impact. <laughs> Two way tie at the top. Three players, just one behind. A handful of players, two behind. taking his time never seems to rush Been around long enough to know that he needs to move at his own tempo that's what's going to work best under pressure yeah, nice chip and putt for a par eight under two-way tie at the top Billy Mayfair Tommy Armour the third. And they move to the par 5 18th. And it's really going to be a horse race tomorrow. It began with Mark O'Meara, who in 1996 became the first pro to play and win with the top flight strata. Soon more and more pros followed. Paul Stankowski, Chris Johnson, Jim Furyk. Today, 150 pros the world over had switched to the Strata, and that's just the beginning. We're going to need a bigger green. We've got the whole day ahead of us, and he had to get heartburn. Who knew they'd have such good onion rings? He still thinks he can eat like a kid. I can. 
I just pay for it. So I told him, would it hurt to take Tagamet with you? Good idea, because Tagamet is fast and it lasts. Tagamet is proven to start reducing stomach acid faster than Pepsid AC. And unlike regular antacids like Mylanta, Tagamet lasts for hours and hours. He never listens. Now I don't have to. <laughs> with Tagamet, you can eat like a kid again. Having taught the game for years, I've seen every mistake imaginable in the golf swing. Like picking the club straight up, over swinging, and the deadly outside in slice swing. That's why I recommend the great big berth at Tungsten Titanium Mines to my students. They're so forgiving. Even if your swing isn't perfect, you can still hit great shots. And that means they not only make the game easier to play, they even make it easier to teach. And I'm all for that. The 1998 Nissan Open is sponsored by Nissan, who reminds you that life is a journey and joy the ride. And by the Top Flight Strata Tour, the number one multi-layer ball on tour. 18T, Tommy Armour, tied for the lead. He can easily reach this green in two. It all sets up by the tee shot. Keep it in the fairway. Driving the ball well all day. Well, he's not leaning one way or the other, so you figure that probably right down the middle. Excellent drive. Up ahead, Scott Hope had to hit his third shot out of a divot. This is for birdie to get to seven. Yes. Minus seven indeed. Scott Hope. Out of 68, he's only one back. Now you got four players at seven under. I think the leader after the day's round will be nine under. One of these two likely to make birdie, Mayfair or Armour. Armour in excellent position. Now Billy Mayfair. Well, Billy will want to get that shot that he dropped back here but he's pushed that one second cut a rough not deep into the trees the errant shot by Tiger here was 330 yards but really off the map you always get more distance when you hit the cart pass yeah. I found that because it ruins the ball but I get more length even aims now for birdie nice way to make your season debut though come right out and get in contention at the Nissan Open Ames shoots 70 just two back Mayfair lost his tee shot a little bit right but not in any harmful danger armor long and straight and minus eight then that uh, group that magnificent seven set of Tiger Woods Skip Kendall Bob Estes Scott Hoke Kendall today setting the course record 64 Tiger still working on a few adjustments that's what it takes get out there and work it out hitting a few metal threes Imagining that he's hitting a second shot to 18 tomorrow. He used that weapon yesterday to knock it on here at 18 and 2. Freddie Funk shoots 70. He's minus 2. Tom Kite had one under with Tom Lehman. His wife, Melissa, carried the bag. Andy Martinez suffered a, an injury, rib injury, during a pickup basketball game and was unable to caddy in a tournament for the first time in, what, 29 years he missed a tournament. So Tom Lehman brought out Melissa he saves a lot of money or maybe cost him more money yeah, I don't know probably cost him more money well tonight on CBS all new episodes Dr. Quinn medicine woman followed by the magnificent seven and then Chuck Norris's Walker Texas Ranger America's night of television tonight on CBS Billy Mayfair will have to shape this second shot. 
That ball kind of went out of sight. I don't think he has a very good lie right there. I don't think he can reach the green in two from there. What do you think we're in store for tomorrow? Well, I'll tell you what. Don't sell out anybody from three under on down because you, we've seen some 64s and fives. I think there could be a 63 sitting in it someplace like that, and uh, you've got a lot of potential good players there that can come, can come out and play. Uh, but the fast start is what you want to do, like Mayfair did today. He buried the first three holes, but you get Tiger Woods with par fives, that's right up his alley. But it's really a... It's anybody's ball game yet. You go all the way back to minus three. That includes John Daly at that figure who shot 66 today. He's been making a whole bunch of birdies this week. Yeah. It'll be interesting tomorrow because everybody likes the course and I'm enjoying doing the tournament here. So Mayfair and Armour to finish 18. Tied for the lead at minus eight. Again, we're apologizing. We can't stay on until the finish. Our local affiliate obligations. But we'll be back here tomorrow. The day starts on CBS Sports. Georgetown, Syracuse. Then some will see Purdue against Michigan State or UCLA, Washington. Then 4 o'clock, the Nissan Open final round coverage back here at Valencia. Another beautiful day expected. Look forward to having you back with us. For Ken Venturi and the entire CBS golf crew, Jim Nance saying good night for now from the Nissan Open. The Blue Monster is one course you don't want to play with sore muscles. So before I tee off, I take Advil. Doctors know Advil works right at the site of pain, stopping it where it starts. It also works great on headaches. Advanced medicine for pain. The greats all suffered for their art. Now it's Art's turn to do the suffering. What a lovely cow. It's not a cow. This is a Buick. All new Cosby, CBS Monday. The address is CBS. Welcome home. First, it's making enough to retire. Then you gotta worry about outliving the money. Well, I'm taking care of that. Now, if I can just... Oppenheimer Funds. The right way to invest. Sam's World of Golf is your golf headquarters. Custom fitting men, women, and juniors. Get the largest selection, best service, and latest in golf equipment. Like Wilson's new staff irons with fat shaft technology. The thicker shafts provide less twist, resulting in more accurate shots even on miss hits. For deadly accuracy and remarkable distance, try Wilson's staff irons with the fat shaft and either steel or graphite. Only from Wilson. Sam specializes in golf. Nothing but golf at the lowest possible prices. Shop and compare, then go to Sam's World of Golf. If you want to get rich fast, try playing the lottery. That's not why I invest. I invest so one day I can have my own shop, be my own boss. Oppenheimer Funds, the right way to invest. For CBS 19 Online, the address is WOIO.com. This is CBS 19 News with Michael Mara and Cynthia Barnes. Live, local, late breaking. Good evening, everyone. Right now, a grandmother and her granddaughter are dead, and another man is fighting for his life after an early morning house fire in Oberlin. And what makes the story even more devastating, the fact that the fire chief says the tragedy could have been avoided. Harry Boomer has details. The fire that destroyed this two-story house took 20 minutes to bring under control. But that was more than enough time for the flames to kill two people. The fire department was here within seconds of the 911 call, but it was not in enough time to save 12-year-old Angie Hamilton nor her grandmother, Irene Springer. The fire department says there were no working smoke detectors in the house. According to the fire chief, a smoke detector might have given them enough time to get out with their lives.